Welcome to Idyllic Journey Channel. Relax while you get to know the best places to travel to. Today, I present to you the most dangerous volcano in the world. As you can see in these images this volcano is surrounded by cities. An eruption of this volcano could affect some 100,000 people in the danger zone. Stay until the end of the film to discover why it is the most dangerous, the destructive capacity it has and how the inhabitants near this volcano are preparing for a colossal eruption. The volcano we are dealing with is the Fuego Volcano in Guatemala. The Fuego Volcano is the most active volcano in Central America and one of the most active in the world. The volcano has an altitude of 3,763 meters. Its eruptions are violent, and it is known to be the most active volcano since the conquest of America since the conqueror Pedro de Alvarado could see it erupting in 1524. He himself left it written in his epistles. Is bare of vegetation above 1300 meters, where basically only lava can be found. Fuego is so active that it erupts roughly every 20 minutes throughout the day spewing small amounts of lava and ash into the sky. The volcano cannot be visited. The mountain is closed to the public. If you wish to see Fuego's eruption safely, the proper way to do it is through the Volcano Acatenango hike. Near the top of Volcano Acatenango, Visitors can have an unobstructed view of Volcano Fuego, which will only be located a few kilometers away. The Central American Volcanic Arc includes a hundred of volcanic formations. Of all of them, the Fuego Volcano is the most active. Now this channel idyllic journey has the pleasure to explain why a massive eruption of this volcano can affect up to 100,000 inhabitants. This is crazy, but the closest town to the volcano is Alatenango, just 5 kilometers away. Alatenango is a normal town with 28,000 inhabitants. In the municipality there is a great variety of commercial and service establishments that attend to the needs of the population. There is even a nightclub. The next large and well-known town, closer to the volcano, is Antigua, Guatemala. It has a population of 60,000 inhabitants. It is only 16 kilometers from the volcano. After the Santa Marta earthquakes that partially destroyed it in 1773, the city was abandoned by all the royal authorities from that moment on the city began to be called the ruined Guatemala. Old Guatemala and the old city. The next hot spot near the volcano is the capital of the country, Guatemala City, with 1 million inhabitants. It is located 60 kilometers away from the volcano cone. And although this may seem far away, 
already in the eruption of 2018. The ash cloud that produced the volcano covered for days the whole city. Barely saw the sunlight. This is a big problem since it is the capital of the country and everything is paralyzed. Now you know the real problem facing the whole country, always living at the expense of this capricious volcano active forever and ever. The entire base of the mountain of Fuego Volcano is a large base of scientific operations. And an arduous work of channeling possible lava flows through channels drilled in the slope of the volcano. Between 50 to 100 years, there is a probability of a massive eruption of scale 6 in the Volcanic Explosion Index. This means that there could be the possibility that part of the volcanic cone could melt, releasing tons of lava that would quickly descend the mountain. The consequences are unpredictable. Finally, I would like to say goodbye with a few moments to relax while you enjoy the view with some spectacular images of this wonderful place. Relax and breathe. If you liked the video please subscribe to the channel activate the notifications button and leave us a comment. Thank you for watching.